this but is But I'm asking you, do you have any empathy with the Palestinian position? I have zero empathy to people that time after time refuse to, to recognize the right of the Jewish state to their homeland, Jewish people in their homeland. I have zero sympathy because I want to, to live in a world where we can live together. How can but you they live deny, together but they deny if my you right have to no zero empathy in your own words with those people? No, it's not what I said. I said I have zero sympathy to the fact that they lost their land. They didn't lose their land. They committed the crime of attacking the small the, the small state yeah. of Israel and, uh, after the UN decision. So do you have they any empathy with the Palestinian people? Absolutely. I think that... What is your empathy? I think, Just I think my it. empathy to the Palestinian people, that we could have had a flourishing region, having the best high tech, the Best no, life. that's an argument. No, no, no. I'm asking we you could have had share a, their pain for so, a moment. So I'll just, I'll just give you an example, okay? The best flourishing economic areas are in Judea and Samaria, where you have factories that have Palestinians and Israelis working together. That could have been the vision everywhere. But when you refuse to recognize the right of a Jew to exist, yeah. this is where it fails. So I think this ideology that doesn't want Jews to exist, this is a tragedy. I don't think that's that, not empathy. No, what I'm trying to say that empathy comes when you have the understanding that I have the right to exist. Unfortunately, there were people in Hamas that they showed that clearly, that they didn't believe that any of the Jewish people in the state of Israel need to exist. So that there is no, that the truth is there is no empathy between you and the Palestinian people. I have empathy the for the people, tragedy of the leadership, I mean, yes. I have empathy that a, they are under the tragedy of their leadership. This is a very hopeless conversation then, isn't it? No, it's not, because I think what's really hopeless is to build imaginary solutions. What's really hopeless is to think that a terror organization is something that will never hurt you. I think that the imaginary and the illusionary discourse that many people have need to be stopped. You cannot build peace on lies and illusions. Anda tidak tahu empatia.